Hello everybody and welcome to this week's episode of Let's Play Junk Junk X. Today we are going to be doing a little bit of building on the build that we started last episode. I think we started the last episode. It is the building that's going to hold all of our achievement items and things like that. But before we do that, I want to try out a couple of things. So uh, last episode, I think it was on last episode, uh, someone by the name of Scream505, I believe, told me that if you encrust shovel, a shovel, um, with tourmaline, I believe it was, that it would be able to work as a pickaxe. Now, I don't know if it's going to be able to work like a higher grade pickaxe or if it's only going to be able to do stone and how fast it is or whatnot, but we're going to try out and if it works decently, for at least building, I think we'll use it. Um, let's go ahead. We'll do two of them. Uh, we'll try one on a gold shovel. And then we'll go ahead and make a titanium shovel. I think I do have enough titanium to maybe start use. Uh, maybe to start using a little bit of titanium tools. Um, but I would prefer to get a little bit more before we get a lot. Um, okay. So, let's just make one shovel for now. Add the titanium titanium bam, bam. so there we go there's one and then uh let's let's see is that a new shovel that's a new shovel let's encrust this one like uh, this and by the way when you encrust because i always get questions about it you have to make a cut gem and then you tap and hold on the cut gem and then it'll ask you what you want to encrust and then you tap on the thing so let's go down here to a little bit of an open area. I'm really curious to see how this works. We're gonna try it out with stone, just your basic stone. So here's the gold one. Um, let's let's compare that. So I think that took, let's see how many taps that took. I don't know how many took. One, two, three, four, five. So that took five taps. How much does a pickaxe take? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, so it's like the same as a gold one. One, two, three. Ooh. Okay, so it works. I'm assuming it just works as well as like the so like the gold shovel will work as best uh, the gold shovel will work as well as the gold pickaxe and the shovel will work as well as the titanium I just totally screwed that up but that's okay what do the stats say on them oh okay so the yeah they do they have a little um pickaxe thing on it hmm that is really cool thank you for that tip that's so awesome I don't have like tons and tons of tourmaline, but I'm definitely going to be using this. I think we will go ahead and let's put some of this stuff away real quick. Go like this. Oops. Go like that and put this stuff away. Um, I think we're just going to use the titanium shovel for today and then uh, maybe I'll go ahead and encrust more because I think it would be definitely worth it to just encrust a ton of titanium. Uh, shovels and then I just don't have to make pickaxes either. So that's that's so cool. That's such a good tip. Just encrust your uh, shovels. It's so cool. Okay, so now that we have that all figured out, I'm just going to go ahead and throw some of this stuff in here and I'll figure out where to put it later. So now we have a whole nother slot in our quick bar, which is super cool and convenient. Um, and one more thing that we have to do before we go out is we need to make some more um, of our... Oops, did I pick that up? Yeah, I did. Oh, and we need to put our tourmaline away. Put our tourmaline away. Uh, one thing, we need to make more of this cracked glass real quick. So, uh, uh, why is this up? Get out of here. Thank you. So, we're just going to uh, make this all into shards. It's a lot quicker than placing the glass and then breaking it. And then go like this. Oh, sweet. We're going to get 43. Nice and bench me, please. Just make these real quick. I probably won't need this much, but you know what? That is okay. Put that there. And I think we are good to go. Um, I have really, really exciting news. If you've been watching me for a while, you know, oh, it's so nice just having this extra slot here. I'll have to figure out what to do with it. Let's figure out our inventory real quick before I blab on about something. So we're going to need these, these. I'm um, definitely going to need my shovel. We can get rid of torches for now. Um, let's see here. We're going to need these. Oh, I forgot to make more pillars. Six is not going to be enough, but that is okay. And uh, let's go ahead. <laughs> Actually, let's do the floor real quick. Um, while, while I jibba jabba. Um, so, I was like, oh, I need my pickaxe. No, I don't. Look at me go. Ooh. 
Uh, so, if you've been watching me for a while, you will know. Can I not break that because of that? Dang it. Uh, if you've been watching me for a while, you will know that I complain about my recorder all the time. Or my- oh, I did not want to do that. Don't do that. Uh, I complain about my adapter all the time that I use to record because it's always just derping around and not working and it's very frustrating and irritating. Well, I finally went to the Apple store and I got a new one! So, uh, I'm just, I was so happy about it. What am I looking for? I already have it on me. Um, it's just, uh, it's so lovely. It's so wonderful. I don't have problems with it because before I literally had a chopstick taped to my adapter and I'm talking about one of the uh, they're like the Apple lightning adapter HDMI things and I had to have a chopstick taped to it so that it would um, not disconnect while I was recording and it was the most irritating thing ever and I finally went to a mall that had an Apple store I was like yeah this stops disconnecting all the time I need a new one. And I, uh, I'll admit, I kind of lied a little bit so that I could make sure I wouldn't get like a refurbished one or something. Um, I did say that I got it as a gift, which was a lie. But um, uh, that was just because I didn't have the receipt. Well, hello, Edgar. Well, hello. Please don't meow the whole time. Can you just like lay down and not talk? And not clean your butthole? That's disgusting. Oh, I hate that sound so much. Okay, so what we're doing right now. I guess I should explain this a little bit, is uh, this is going to be the floor, obviously, because it's, it's on the floor. Um, hello? I told you, no jibber-jabbering. Um, so, I have these here to light up this bottom floor. Oh, my gosh. To light up this bottom floor, and then I'm also going to put water over them, uh, which will make them more of a white instead of, this is kind of like a beige right now. So it'll make them a little bit white. Let's actually go ahead and get a bucket. Get out of the way, turtle. Let's grab a bucket and just uh, do one. I'll probably do this off camera just because buckets don't stack and things. And it'll take a while because the whole length of the building is um, 37 blocks, I believe. So that is a lot of water to transport. Let's see here. And now he's sneezing on things. Edgar, why do you come into my room at the most inconvenient times. <laughs> okay, let's go back and show it. So, uh, like I said, this will turn it white and it just it kind of looks cooler. So, that's what I'm going to do with this way. Like that, see? It makes it white. It's kind of cool, right? Right, right, right. And then when you zoom out, it does make it blue, but that doesn't really matter. Uh, and along here, we're going to place some more... Oops, showcases. Not like that. Get out of here. Not like that. And then, uh, did I accident? No, I didn't. Um, I'm actually, before I had these, the Mineshaft X, uh, pillars? Really? That's a ladder. But okay, whatever. Uh, before I was using those as ladders, but now I'm going to use these instead. So let's just go like this. And let's count here. How many, how many sections do we have done? One, two, three sections done. And I believe, uh, there's still one more section. I think. Ugh, it's so confusing. I don't really understand it. Um, it's kind of bad when you don't understand your own design. I think it repeats one more time. Let's actually get up here. It would make more sense when I see the roof. Um, we're actually going to change the roof a little bit on the end, but I will wait until we finish more of the building. Um, okay, so what we're going to use is these limestone bricks, and we need to get up onto the roof somehow. And I don't know what the most efficient way to do that is. I'm just, I'm just gonna go up. Let's let's just do whatever. Um, and let's use some back blocks. So this is gonna go up like this. Um, this is actually supposed to go down one more, but we can fix that later. This goes up three. Correct? Yes, correct. Yes, Kylie, you are correct. Okay, and then this goes up three. And then uh, obviously it's gonna repeat because it is a riff. So like that, let's actually just grab our shovel here and go down. Um, so uh, this one will be three, like I said. Let's go three down. These actually go down four? Four? Yes, four? Okay. Uh, one side, it looks like I screwed it up from the pictures I'm looking at. So go like that. Is that four? That is four. 
Uh, it is getting dark out, so let's go ahead and go sleep. So, um, the roof, uh, did I, oh, I picked up my bed. That's right. I had to pick it up. Um, yeah, we're sleeping. So, uh, underneath the roof that we just made, we're going to repeat another one of these little sections that we've already been doing. And so that means this center section here will have glass all down it. Um, so we can grab this glass that we just did. And I just pooped out a fuse! I refuse to poop out a fuse. That didn't really make any sense, but that's okay. And then, uh, we need to start up another one of these. We need to get ourselves some back blocks. I didn't realize when you're making a mass amount of showcases, showcases are so expensive. They're so expensive. Okay, and then we need a ladder. So while I'm doing more of these, I'm going to talk about some more good news. So if you have been um, one of the people that has been having issues with the world downloads and it just won't work for whatever reason, uh, one of you guys, his name is Jester, Jesper. Je Jasper? Jester? I think it's Jester. <laughs> uh, he messaged me, or we were talking in the comments about it, and he figured out how to fix it! Oh my god! I'm not gonna tell you exactly how to fix it in the video, but there will be um, a detailed explanation and like the, like a brief step-by-step -step thing on how to do it. So if you've been having issues with the world download and um, the pause screen crashes for you, um, or when you go to the pause screen it crashes, or um, what's another one of the issues? Oh, you can't go through portals, which is like a big deal. Um, this should fix it for you, hopefully. Uh, what do I need to do here? I need to, uh, go like this. Um, so this should fix it for you. Um, this only works for iFile. If you're having the issues with something like iPhone box or, uh, what am I looking for? Pillars. If you're having the issue with something like iPhone box or iExplorer, I still don't know how to fix it through there. I know what the issue is. I just don't know how to fix it. Um, it has to do with files, um, just being like set to the wrong settings or like the wrong permission settings or something like that. Um, so they're pretty easy to fix in iFile, um, which you need to have a jailbroken device to get to. I'm not actually sure if there is an iFile for the computer. There might be. I've never looked, so I don't know. Um, and if there is, you might be able to fix it that way. I'm not really sure. But like I said, there's going to be um, an explanation, and I might eventually make a video for it if um, you guys ask me to. But it's it's pretty simple. And, uh, so, yeah, that'll be in the description. Oh, my gosh. Uh, Jasper, Jes Jesper, J Jester, Jester. <laughs> oh, man, I keep screwing up your name. I'm so sorry. But, oh, man, you saved me so many, so many hours just clicking around, trying to move around files, not understanding what's going on. Because I don't really understand file settings at all. I'm not, like, inept with technology or anything. But, man, I just don't understand it sometimes. Um... And we need to repeat this one more time. This build is extremely repeaty, so I'm sorry if this is boring. The next section will be, will actually be different. Um, and we need to get up here. Oh, wow. Okay, so this top part is actually different. It has some fancy chandelier placing. Let's see here. Uh, uh, I don't know what I'm doing. There we go. So we need to get our bridges out, and we also need to get our... Um, chandeliers out right here. Uh, I think we're good. So, bridge right there, chandelier. And then let's go down. And then I believe there is another bridge right here. And then, uh, another chandelier. And then there will be a bridge right... Ooh, did I do that wrong? No, there's a bridge on the block that I'm standing on. That would make more sense. Bridge there, chandelier. Yep, got it. Okay. So that is that, and then once we place this pillar, we can actually start on uh, a section that is different, because nothing has been different. We've literally just been repeating the same pattern for like ever. Um, okay, let's get rid of these blocks. I don't really know how these happen. You can see I ended up having to take out a chunk of this hill here, and there is back black blocks, which I always have such a hard time saying, uh, but we shouldn't run into an issue with them because glass blocks, as you can see, makes them disappear, except for when you zoom out. But that doesn't really matter. So we're going to do uh, a 3x3 three three up with 
some um, bridge, wood bridge, and then stone bridge. And we're going to place some Atula chandeliers right there with these bridges going up. And then pretty much all along this back wall is just going to be, uh, the middle strip will be glass because this is the only section that you're going to be able to see. Um, but the rest is going to be, I need to figure out what this actually stops. I think it stops here. It should stop level with the, the, uh, top peak of the, oh no, it stops right here. There we go. So that's where that stops, I think. Did I screw that up? How did I screw that up? Uh... Ooh, I did screw that up. Hold on. <laughs> Alrighty, well, I did indeed screw this up, which is not uh, much of a shocker, because <laughs> I always screw up my builds while I'm just jabbing away. So, uh, that was just like a mumble of mush, but whatever. Um... So, uh, I missed one more pillar. There's like one more section that you repeat again. I forgot how repeaty this build is because I built it quite a while ago. Um, so I just did a wood pillar straight up on the outside of the marble brick roof that we just made. And now we are going to put another roof out, which goes three up three. There's a little peak there and then oops, out three again. So, like, like this. Oops, not like that. Not like that. Come back. Like that. And then, uh, this one goes out one more. Like this. Which, uh, this might actually be a bad idea, because now it's gonna make everything super dark down here. It's not too bad. Um, so this was the extra little section that I added on. This more glass goes up. I'm not going to. We can take out these. Um, there will be more pillars here, but I am out of pillars. I'm just going to put torches through here for now. Um, there will eventually be chandeliers, but um, I'm using the chandeliers for a different section because we only have two more for right now. Let's go ahead and put a showcase right there, and there will be another chandelier down here. So now we can repeat this glass section here with the bridges. Bling blong! I just got an email. Um, oh my god. Oh my god, I've been having the best time ever. Um, there is a website called Humble Bundle. It's a really great site. It um, it donates like 10% of everything, at least 10% of everything that it makes uh, to two different charities and things. And uh, we don't need to put a ladder actually from... There's going to be bridges instead of ladders. From here here on up so we can go ahead and get rid of these please don't break the glass thank you um but anyways humble bundle is having such a good sale right now each day they have different games for only 99 cents and i mean some of them there's really not any like triple like triple a tile games but like 99 cents for a game that's crazy and um like i got psychonauts yesterday for only 99 cents and that game's usually ten dollars and um they are also having a completely 100% free game. Uh, what am I looking for? My showcases. They're having um, a free game every week. I think originally it was going to be... I could have sworn it said that... Oh, wait. We need to get rid of these. Um, I could have sworn that it said that there was going to be a free game every day. But then it ended up only being once a week. I don't know if I misread that or what. But could have sworn. So, uh, from here on up, we're doing bridges instead of ladders. And this is so, uh, I can add lighting into this middle section here. Uh, like this. We're gonna go, uh, we'll start adding them right here. So that way I can move this bridge up to here. Um, and go like this. And then ice, ice. Glass needs to go all the way up. And bridges. Bridges, what are you? Bridges are gonna, oops, go across like this. You you are not supposed to be there yet because I need to place my bridges first. Like this. Uh, when you're placing showcases, background blocks just don't really matter. It doesn't matter what you used. Um, but it just needs to be a background block because you can't see it anyways. So this is what we have so far. There's going to be more lighting in here. I'll probably go ahead and um, continue the flooring and finish the flooring off camera as well as placing the water just so that we have that ready. 
Um, but next episode, we will finish this up. It's literally just this mirrored on the other side now. So I might actually go ahead and build some of it off camera just because it is completely repeated. So it's, uh, yeah, it's literally just the same thing on the other side because I tried to actually do something symmetrical for once, which is crazy. Uh, and, uh, the only thing we'll probably do on this next episode is I want to fix the roof over in this section ish here. Uh, but starting next episode, we're probably going to start working on some achievements, like getting the trinkets, different fishing things, etc. Cause you guys just love it when I fish. Um, and all that stuff will go in here as well as food. I'm hoping that I will have enough room. I tried to put in a showcase wherever I could, and I hope that mobs don't spawn in here. Oh, you know what? I'm actually on. Uh, there we go. I was surprised there really wasn't that many mobs around, but that was probably why. Uh, I turned it off when I was trying to clear out that hill because there were just mobs everywhere. I was like, you know, I want to clear out this hill, and you are in my way. So I just, I just clicked over to peaceful because, because I can. Uh, but that is, uh, let's get back over into our main world. I think this is going to be about it. Uh, I don't think there's really anything else that I have to talk about. Check out the description if you had problems with the world download, uh, for the instructions with iFile. And, uh, thank you for this shovel thing. It's, it's pretty cool. I wonder if it takes more damage when, um, if it takes more damage than what a pickaxe normally would. Um, but it does say that it works as a pickaxe. You can see there's a pickaxe and then a shovel next to the 3.00, um, kind of like this. And I wonder, I wonder what tourmaline does to other things. I'm kind of curious. I kind of want to encrust other things with tourmaline and see what it does. Or just like encrust other tools. I usually don't encrust tools just because I go through tools so quickly that it doesn't seem worth it. But I don't know. I don't know that I'm going to use the shovel tourmaline, the, the tourmaline shovel thing uh, when I go mining and stuff just because I don't want to like blow through so much of it. Um, but for building and stuff, it's really nice because it, it frees up uh, another um, quick slot and so I just need to grab one thing instead of two, which is super nice and super convenient. Uh, but yeah, I think that is going to be about it for today. Thank you for watching this week's episode of the Slayer Dragon Flu. Please like and subscribe and all that stuff. And thank you. Goodbye.